तो वॉट हैपन्स वेन एज अ वुमेन यू वर्क इन अ ब्यूरोसी वेदर इट इज़ अ कॉपरेट ब्यूरोसी और इट इज़ अ स्टेट ब्यूरोसी फॉर अ लॉन्ग पीरियड ऑफ टाइम ब्यूरोसी डो नॉट ट्रस्ट एनी थिंग इ रैशनल मीन्स सॉरी इ रैशनल की टर्म इज नॉट अप्रोप्रिएट इन फैक्ट ब्यूरोसी डज नॉट ट्रस्ट योर इमोशंस योर इंटोशन एंड योर इमोशन इंटोशन बोथ ऑफ दैम बिलोंग्स टू ऑल्सो फिजिक फिजियोलॉजिकली अगर आप अपनी बॉडी के अंदर देखें तो वो कहाँ पे अमर्ज होती है इंटोवेशन और इमोशंस दोनों चीज़ें कहाँ पे होती हैं आपके दिमाग में एंड योर योर गट इज इन्वॉल्व गट इज नाउ बींग रिकगनाइज एज योर सेकेंड ब्रेन पता है आपको योर गट नाउ बींग रिकगनाइज एज योर सेकेंड ब्रेन हाँ तो वो गट फीलिंग इसी वजह से होती है तो ब्यूरोसी की जो रूट्स है ना हिस्टोरिकल मैरियन वुडमेन ने पूरा एक आर्टिकल लिखा अपनी किताब के अंदर इसके अंदर तो शी सेंग के Uh, it goes back to like 2000 years you can there is this antagonism ke our body is the source of trouble our mind is the source of salvation and our body is the source of lots of troubles wo sari temptations bhi aapki body mein emerge hoti hain theek hai and the the body tempts you to do all that uh, dirty stuff also to utna push kiya uh, body ko dur unhone ke eventually they created this disconnect from the body in itself ठीक है तो यूरोपियन पूरा जो डिस्कोर्स है सिविलाइजेशन कल्चर एवरीथिंग इज वेरी मच अगेंस्ट एनी थिंग दैट इज हैपनिंग बिलो ठीक है ट्राई टू यू नो क्वारंटीन ऑल द थिंग्स विच आर हैपनिंग बिलो योर नेक सही और ये जो डिस्कनेक्ट है दैट इज देयर इन द मेडिकल डिस्कोर्स दैट इज देयर इन द ब्यूरोसी दैट इज देयर ऑलमोस्ट एवरीवेयर सही एंड फेमिन इज ऑल्सो योर इट हैपन्स इन योर बॉडी जितने भी फेमिन कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स हैं दे आर नेशनल फीचर्स ऑफ योर बॉडी ठीक है and bureaucracy is against that it does not trust literally so you sari policy sari framework pura jo structure banta hai kisi bhi bureaucratic institution ke andar that make sure ki the system is responsible for doing everything you do not put individuals in charge but individual pe kisi bhi insaan ke upar dependency is not allowed in, in a bureaucratic system why because insaan bring all of his all of these irrational stuff with him with or with her then subsequently that irrational part of your being is the source of trouble mistakes are not allowed in bureaucracy everything has to be predictable emotions insaan ke predictable hote hain no theek hai jo insaan ki jo feminine side hai that is very unpredictable it is erratic it, it you know can go in any any direction any time to so bureaucracy has a strong bias against the feminine and all those places in your system jahan pe the feminine characteristics exist रिकार्डो सेमलर की एक टॉक है एम आई टी के अंदर उसकी वीडियो इज अवेलेबल ऑन यूट्यूब रिकार्डो सेमलर इज अ ब्राजीलियन आंटरप्रन्योर एंड मैनेजमेंट थिंकर और वो अपनी एग्जाम्पल दे रहा है एक बंदे की मतलब रिकार्डो सेमलर इज वन ऑफ दोज पीपल जो एक्सटेंसिवली एडवोकेट के आप मैनेजमेंट डिसीजन के अंदर आप इंटोवेशन को इस्तेमाल करें ठीक है वो इंटोवेशन की जस्टिफिकेशन के अंदर और मतलब हाउ मच मैनेजमेंट कन्वेंशनल मैनेजमेंट थिंकिंग is actually biased against the use of intuition uski wo example de raha tha apni talk ke andar and the example is about this senior executive in in an oil and gas company aur wo baith ke analysis kar raha hai ki aaj se koi 6 mahine ke baad oil ki prices kya hongi theek hai to ricardo samler usse puchta hai ki do you uh, the, does your intuition tell you ke prices jo hai wo kahan par hongi aage piche and uh, this the guy said yes i do keep a note of ki meri intuition jo hai wo kya mujhse keh rahi hai mere meri gut feeling jo hai wo what what is it actually telling me about the prices and stuff so and he said ke why don't you use your intuition and sorry he first asked the person ke do you tell your board members ke this is my intuition and according to my intuition this is going to be the price of the oil and he said no and he said ke, why don't you do that uh, despite the fact uh, his intuition was turning out to be much more accurate as compared to his scientific analysis whatever he was doing तो एक ऑटो सामने पूछता है कि डिस्पाइट द फैक्ट वेन इट इज ए मोर एक्यूरेट तो वाई डोंट यू टेल टू योर बोर्ड मेंबर्स के भाई दिस इज माई इंटोशन एंड अकॉर्डिंग टू माई पास रिकॉर्ड जो बता रहे हैं कि माई इंटोशन हैज बिन मोर एक्यूरेट बिन माई साइंटिफिक एनालिसिस तो वो लिटरली बोलता है कि आई हैव द राइट टू बी रॉन्ग बट आई आई हैव टू बी प्रिसाइसली रॉन्ग एंड आई कैन नॉट टेल माई बोर्ड मेंबर्स कि मैं बैठा हुआ था स्विमिंग पूल के में और वहाँ पे एक जो है वो आई वो प्लेंग विद माई डॉग एकदम से नंबर एक पॉप डॉप इन टू माई माइंड एंड दिस इज वॉट द नंबर एक्चुअली इज they want to see an analysis numbers graphs calculations blah 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 all of these things us pe wo satisfied and despite the fact that all of that analysis is going to you know give me a wrong number so they are they are okay with me being wrong 
even if I'm using scientific analysis. Because unka barosa kis pe? Scientific analysis ke par, not on my intuition. Despite the fact track record is saying ke my intuition is more accurate. Okay, so like those are some interesting examples. The bureaucracy is against intuition. Bureaucracy is against anything which is emerging in your body. Okay, because it cannot really understand what what it is there, and or also control karna is also not that easy. So what happens when, as a woman, you work in a bureaucracy, whether it is a corporate bureaucracy or it is a state bureaucracy, for a long period of time? You will eventually have to suppress your feminine side for a very long period of time and the, for the time you are working for the bureaucracy and you have to bring out your masculine side Achha, when you when as a woman you are suppressing it you, are you suppressing more as compared to men or you are suppressing less as compared to men why because your feminine side is a bit more as compared to males okay and what happens when you suppress you get all of these psycho psychological or emotional or physical illnesses i know somebody who is in usa uh, whose mother died like uh, uh, a week back and the funeral was on friday and person's workplace is expecting the person to be normal and just perform just the way he was performing before. And he was like, yeah, what do I do? And everybody's pushing, ke, bhai, matab, get over it, just, just start doing your work. There's nothing wrong with that. Your mother died for God's sake. So, if this person will suppress your grief, karega, to grief ka suppression can be very right. devastating for your physical health also. Okay, you know, in the USA, ke andar, life expectancy is less than Costa Rica. USA ki life expectancy, despite the fact they spend like $3 trillion on healthcare, is a lot less than uh, many developing or underdeveloping countries. Joe Merchant's book is a book that has written in the whole critique in the last chapter. Despite the fact that the U.S. is spending like three trillion dollars on healthcare, its bawajood, the life expectancy hai, and the, the prevalence of different non-communicable diseases. Ki. Non-communicable diseases are what? Cancer, cardiovascular, obesity. So uh, it leads to lots of these non-communicable diseases. Blood pressure diabetes, so all of these non-communicable, uh, autoimmune, the autoimmune ki bahut sari tights hain, 80-90% of the deaths in the dunya ke they are happening from non-communicable diseases. Number one is cardiovascular diseases, number two is cancer, number three is pata nahi, diabetes hai kaun si. But, surat ehal ye hai USA ke andar ke despite the fact, and, and Gabor Mate ki jo talk agar aap, documentary agar aapne dekhi hai, you would understand ke what exactly is causing these people to have the, all of these diseases. It is that unprocessed trauma which they suppress karte rahte, karte rahte, and eventually that destroys their health. The Gabor Marte is when the body says no. In her chapter, ke he is talking about a different disease. She has talked autoimmune, baat ki hai, isne, IBS, ke baat ki hai, irritable bowel syndrome, cancer ki different types of baat ki hai, in different chapters. Hai, all of them, according to him, are because of suppression of anger and uh, all, all of these difficult emotions and grief and everything else. Okay, so basically you are actually suppressing your feminine side. Achha, this also implies a very interesting insight. Brings out a very interesting insight. And in fact, Jungian psychology and trauma psychology, you name it. But the, 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 the therapeutic experiences I have posted this in the group. I don't know. The therapeutic methods, hai, therapeutic, I'm talking about thera- therapy for your emotional issues. All of these therapeutic methods or environments or techniques, all of them involve an excessive exposure to masculine and feminine. But Jungian psychology is openly saying that in the Western society, there are many things that are not going Why? Because they have feminine side. Suppressed. And they're deeply traumatized because of that. So, the way feminine heals. And feminists are doing today? The irony, <laughs> exactly, the mother of all ironies right now is. Feminists, when they're trying to be more masculine, they're, try, uh, they're trying women to be more masculine despite, without, you know, addressing the root cause of the problem. Just say, not just women are suffering, males are also suffering because of that. So that is why I say that the feminists are literally sitting on a gold mine, and they're literally fighting for scraps. They're sitting on a gold mine, but they're fighting for scraps because it's a major issue in the world at this time. Because the amount Joby society is modernized, or modernization is going on. They are also becoming more and more traumatized. And that is becoming literally a major cause of uh, reducing life expectancy and death and all of this perpetual torture you, actually, you have to actually experience when you are alive. And the cure is right here, in your face. Staring at you and 
मतलब आई डोंट थिंक एनी फेमिनिस मतलब एक्सेप्ट मेरियन वुडमैन मेरियन वुडमैन ने इस पर लिखा है ठीक है मेरियन वुडमैन ने लिखा है आई थिंक मेरी वोन फ्रांस ने लिखा है इसके ऊपर यूनियन साइकोलॉजिस्ट तो फेमिन साइड की बात करते हैं कैटागोरिकली डिलीटरी वॉन्ट यू टू ब्रिंग इट आउट और वो जो उनका जो पूरा थेरापोटिक मैथड है तो आपकी जात के अंदर जहाँ पर सप्रेस हुई हुई थी फेमिन एस्पेक्ट्स वो उसको निकालते हैं थ्रू देर थेरापी ठीक है एंड दे ट्राई टू क्रिएट दिस बैलेंस बिटवीन योर मेस्कुलन साइड एंड the feminine side